Oh, you are, but you are bleeping. That's not a good sign. Hello there from Alton Towers. It's Nemesis Reborn opening day. I'm Scott. I've got Stephen here. I've got Mark somewhere. Where's he gone? In the sunshine. In the sunshine. Here we are, Forbidden Valley. Nemesis Reborn opening day. Are you excited, Stephen? Very excited for this one. Yeah. What Classic B and M. Yeah. What are you expecting from Nemesis Reborn? The same, slightly different. What the ride, you... the ride experience is the same, but I think it's going to be amazing at night, looking at all the effects they put in. Yeah. And it, I like the older B and M's, and as far as I'm aware, it's the same ride, like for like. So yeah. it's going to be ace. Yes. So we're going to go jump in the queue now. But in this video, you can expect basically a full walkthrough of Forbidden Valley. Daytime, nighttime, interactions with any characters that are here, and there's plenty of characters here. But yeah, it's time to go and get that first ride. Let's go. Come on, Mark, let's do this. Let's go. Are you excited? Very excited. Good very, stuff. Very, very excited. Looks, looks incredible so far. What are you expecting? Same or? Just the same. It'll yeah. ride the same, I would imagine. But the area looks incredible. I've got, you know, it's, it's one of them that they have changed it so much that. It's just, it's just so good to see. Join the Nemesis queue. Bad news. It starts by the rapids. <laughs> you alright, Stephen? Yeah, yeah, doing a little bad. bit of moaning about this queue, but no, it's going to be a long queue. But I think it's going to be worth it overall. Yeah, um, you've got to do it, haven't you? Well, obviously, that's why we're here. We've not come for runaway mine trade today, have we? Well, you did, but. Yeah, well, nah, I've come for the whole experience, really. But yeah. I, think, I think it's going to be tricky to get out of Forbidden Valley today. Yeah, it is. So. One thing we've always needed on this channel was like a really big Alton Towers fanboy, and it's great that we've got Steven now, because we have got the Alton Towers fanboy that we've always missed. So, you are our Alton Towers guide, aren't you? So, yeah. it's good, isn't it, Mark? We've always needed an Alton Towers sort of rep on the channel, and we've yeah, got well, Steven now. Steven, the Alton Towers enthusiast. So this is the one-hour checkpoint. Mark's hiding in his coat there. The old 80, Towers uh, guide is there with us still. 84 years later. 84 years later. Yeah, this is the one hour checkpoint and we've reached the Curse of Alton Manor. So, uh, yeah, we're getting there. We're getting there. We've asked everyone that's come and said hello to bring us some snacks though. But no one's brought us any, have they? Uh, wasting away. Yeah, just getting starving now. We've just tried to order from Woodcutters on uh, Just Eat, but unfortunately they're not allowed in. So, yeah, we're just going to have to waste away. The uh, coach house confectionery's not open. 
for any uh, chocolate muffins or out like that today. But yeah, there's a grave digger behind us. There he goes. You all right, Stephen? Yeah, not too bad. Yeah, you sure? I know you were not so sure about this, but what are you thinking so far? I'm looking forward to that. Good stuff. <laughs> I thought you were going to go and get a pizza pasta. To be fair, I could go and get one of pizza. Go and ask him. In fact, that's a good idea. Go and see if they do takeaway. I, I think you do, if you ask. Yeah, you will I'll, do one. I'll have garlic pizza, mate. It's expensive. Yeah. I don't know, you might not do now. Yeah, it's you'll be fine. Thing, wasn't it? Go and sort it out, Stephen. I'll sort something out. What's that, Drew? What do you think of the new archway? Um, the first impression I got when we actually walked up towards the back of the queue was it looks very X sector, which is a bit of a shame. But I, don't, I, I need to have a look around Galactica and see if that's kind of changed to fit with the Nemesis theme. They basically, now they need to make it into a Nemesis themed area, in my opinion. I agree. And the flying coaster needs to get V themed. As much as I do like Galactica and the, the space theme, I like something that isn't as dark, but they've made it a dark area, so they're going to have to kind of do that at some point, I think. But yeah, no, I like it. It's, it's all right. What do you think? I, I, I want to see it at night. Yeah. Get a full true impression because it reminds me, like, when you walk to around 13, but then it'll come at night and you see it all glowing green. It looks really good, so I'm hoping that this will start to glow red come night time. Oh, it's going to. You see the yeah. lights are there, so it's yeah. going to look amazing. Great news, we are in Forbidden Valley. After about 90 minutes of queuing, we're finally in here. The new helicopter, Lake Charge, replacing Nemesis gun looks, looks incredible, especially when you can see people walking up and down past it really adds something to the area and again it just shows that they've really thought about the whole phalanx story for this area now it's not forbidden valley always used to feel a little bit like it lacked theming but now i don't think it does it, it looks brilliant take videos of this product okay no worries any particular reason no comments no comment How are you coping, Mark? It's got a bit cold now. Yeah, now the rain's staying a little bit. It's getting a bit chilly, so hopefully the rain will clear up and warm up a little bit. Yeah, yeah. How long have we been queuing? Three and a half hours now. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we're nowhere near the front yet. <laughs> no, it's when you when you see people who like are an hour in front of you and they still look on it. Yeah, it's like it's a long time to go. So probably about another hour and a half. Yeah, we'll be fine. We'll be fine. We'll be very wet by the time we get on it. Let's bring Stephen in. He was excited to join this queue. You all right, mate? Oh, very excited to join this queue. <laughs> yeah. It has been an exhilarating experience. Exhilarating? A roller coaster ride in the queue line itself. From That's beginning it. to, well, halfway through. Is that right? It is, yeah. But look, you've got to see the positive side of it. Oh, we knew we were in for the long haul, so... And it's quite nice to be able to see the ride run in. You don't have to convince me, I'm quite happy. Well, it is a bit wet now, though, isn't it? You know, it's it's, it's nice cold. It's cold. I'm not cold, I'm just... I'm cold. I just wish the rain would go away. Oh, back in shot. Um, yeah, there you go. Oh, <laughs> too close, that. Too back close. In, that's 4K. You know, too, too, too jazzy. Too, 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 too jazzy. <laughs> too when you're at theme park, yeah, make sure you bring snacks when you're in a fork, you're up a bed. A four hour key.
so close now to getting on Nemesis. Mark, are you excited? Can't wait for it now. Yeah. Really can't wait for it. Like, it's been so good to walk around and you see the coaster going around and the atmosphere's been good, but get me on it, get me on that train now. Yeah, but we're not far now, the queue is moving again. Here we go. So there is a new merge point as well, which is worth mentioning. We are on a hill, so it is difficult to film. But there is a new merge point for, I guess, in Fast Pass and from Rap. I'm not 100% sure if Rap will come in there or at the exit, but it's a new merge point for Fast Pass anyway. Comes up where the old main queue used to come up. But yeah, the, the views in this queue line are absolutely stunning. I've never actually been up where we've been today in the old sort of queue line, which they've utilised for this new queue line because the queue like basically closed it off before I ever went on Nemesis back in the 2000s so I was late to the party with the original Nemesis didn't go on it until 2005 but wow the views from this queue line absolutely incredible but now let's go and have a look at the station let's see what they've changed in there and let's get on this incredible roller coaster What do you think of Nemesis Reborn? We have finally been on it. Yeah, yeah. Um, I got a cramp when I sat in the seat. <laughs> no, I'll be honest, I was in quite a bit of pain. But the ride is really good. Yeah, it's good to get back on it. Yeah, I, I did enjoy the ride, but I was screaming in agony. <laughs> so I'm going to have to try it again later on. Um, I don't know what's playing up. I mean, I had a bit of pain last night. Do you know what it is? It's called age. Yeah, I'm, I'm not made for it nowadays. But the ride was really good. I did enjoy the ride. Excellent. So we need to do it again later in the dark, and I'm sure I'll be fine that time. It's just yes. awful. When I sat down, I was like, ah! <laughs> we'll definitely be going on it in the dark. Yeah. Right, let's bring good. Mark in. What do you think, Mark? Good to get back on it. Yeah. It really, really was good. Row 8 as well. I was just going to say, do you want to mention where we sat? <laughs> Row 8. Yeah. It was just, it was just, it was just, it was just so good and just to get back on it and you know, just, just feel happy on it. It's yeah. Just, it's just a great, great ride. It, 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 this area lacked something when it wasn't in it last year. And now, back better than ever. It really is. The thing is, with a helicopter and the extra theming, I feel like Forbidden Valley always lacked something now. Yeah. I almost feel like it's better than it's ever been in this area. Yeah, we're obviously the helicopter up there, the helicopter in the queue line, the, the bits of scenery that they've added around the queue line. It just, it just, they really have taken it to another level. Absolutely. Hello, my friend. How do you? Dr. Whitaker, nice to see you. How are you, sir? How are you? It's very snazzy in my red yeah, attire. Very jazzy. Sorry, too jazzy, too jazzy. Too jazzy, always, too always too jazzy. jazzy. Did you know this oh. is Tommy Hilfiger? Yeah, absolutely, you can tell. Hello. Can you Hello, check then. this guy here? Scan him. Oh, me? I'm detecting some biological... Oh. Just extra-dimensional energy. Do you have biological in nature? Yes, uh, we're getting an 11. An 11? An 11, he only goes up to 10, sir. Oh, what's that mean? Definitely contaminated. Contaminated? You can monitor. eye and the tentacles as the trains going around the track the eye moves and it follows the train just before the train goes over the station and over the eye it lets out a load of smoke and so the eye goes a little bit mad as if it's really really angry at the train's presence the way that they've done it the way that they've synced it with the movement of the train 
and the tentacles as you can see moving and the eye moving as the train's going round is absolutely incredible. It's more than I ever expected that they would do. You know a lot of parks do retract their coasters. They don't go to this level to do things like that behind me with the eye, with the tentacles, with the theming. You don't have to completely re-theme or re-theme a refurbished roller coaster, but Alton Towers have gone the extra mile. They have done. Here we go. It's going to start moving now. The train is going round. It's going to get angry. Here comes the train. It's going to go over now. It's going to get angry. There we go. It's not happy about it. Yeah, they have done absolutely incredibly. They could have just retracked this coaster, kept the theme in the same, kept the area the same, kept the trains the same. But no, they've rethemed everything. The trains are the same trains, but the refurb trains, just brilliant. They have done an incredible job and yeah, we're gonna spend the rest of the day in Forbidden Valley. We're gonna be here for a night ride on Nemesis Reborn. The queue won't be four hours this time but it will still be great to get on it, see the queue in the dark, see the ride with all the red lighting, the mist, and all the other stuff that's going on. So yeah, excellent. Alt Towers, you have smashed it. Is, is that what you're worrying about? No, no, I'm just, I'm just saying the atmosphere is amazing here tonight and I'm really looking forward to getting a night ride on Nemesis. Nemesis Reborn? Nemesis, that's always going to be Nemesis to me. But yeah, Nemesis Reborn. They've done a cracking job with uh, making a, a new ride out of something old. Yeah. I think they've, they've knocked it out of the park in every aspect. So all my expectations have been exceeded. So yeah, I think it's been a really good day, even though we haven't done many rides. It's been about Nemesis today, and we always knew it was going to be about Nemesis today. And can we go on Nemesis again now? I'm, yeah. going, I'm going, I'm leaving you. All right, like, stop. Yeah, bye. Stop worrying. Wait, wait, wait. Josh! He's, he's off. It, he's off. He's actually gone. He's actually gone, hasn't he? Yes. Looking forward to another go? Absolutely. Should we go and fight Stephen? Yeah, he's probably about 20 minutes in front of us now anyway, so we'll get a better night ride anyway. Yeah, we will. Right, 95 minute queue this time. That's short in comparison. Let's go. Right, so unfortunately we've not got a Nemesis Reborn for the night ride. Uh, it has experienced a technical delay about 20 minutes before park close. Uh, lift stop, lift stop lift evac, stop. queue evac. So you know what, I said in a vlog the other day or a video from home, these things happen. Downtime does happen on rides that have been running empty for weeks. Put people on them, they will have downtime. So. No problem really for me. It's been no, a good all day, hasn't it? Really? Yeah. As well. It's been a great day, hasn't it? Really? Yeah. For the really whole awesome. time we've been in Forbidden Valley, which has been about nine hours, yeah. there's literally been like two stoppages. Yeah. You yeah. can't really argue with that. But we didn't queue nine hours, by the way. <laughs> we were just in the whole area for that long. We didn't really go anywhere else. There is a full Alton Towers vlog coming from me and Mark, isn't there, in a few days' time? Yeah, so that'll be out on Tuesday. But all in all, what do you think of Nemesis Reborn area? Fantastic. Yeah. The work that they've done to that. It's simply incredible. It yeah. really, really is. And you can see that the, the level that they've taken, the ride, that was good anyway, and elevated it by adding the theming around it, the lighting at night, you know, they, they've set the bar very, very high for whatever comes next. But it is, the magic is definitely coming back to this place. Definitely. Yeah. Absolutely. What do you think, Stephen? I agree. I think it's a massive improvement on what they've done in the past. I'm glad they're up in the game. I think everything's been on point. At the end of the day, the numbers speak themselves. Sold out today. Sold out tomorrow. It's Probably going to sell out. Well, yeah. 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 You know, and rightfully so. They've done a great job with. Well, they've done a great job with the ride. It, it, you know, it's good. 
It is good. It it's is a shame we didn't get a night ride, Dave, but it is good. We're going to come back on Easter weekend. Easter, Easter gonna weekend, get a night ride on it. But, but honestly, it, I'm still not. I know we're not going on it, but I'm not walking away disappointed because no. the lighting around there, seeing it go round, seeing mm. it all lit up. It, it looks incredible. It really, really does, and I'm so glad that we've come today. This has been an experience that we'll never get again. Nemesis Reborn opening day. The next time they have to do this, we're all going to be like really old. So, I mean, the technology's a lot better now. I can't see them having to redo it again in 30 years. It'll last longer. I don't know if I'll be riding coasters in 30 years, to be honest. But at the end of the day, I had to be here to experience it, and I know you guys felt the same. Yeah, yeah. I think you do need to come and experience it, especially when you, you know, the work that you've done on the station itself, the inside the station. You know, you've not just left it how it was; you've just added to it. And I am, I say, I'm so, so glad that we've come today. Yeah, top decision. So in the coming days, we have another Alton Towers vlog. There will be a full Forbidden Valley Nemesis type, you know, walk through off ride footage. There'll be a full Nemesis review for me and Mark, I think, on Tuesday as well. Or coming, well, film. See you later, Digital Dan. <laughs> Bye. Bye. Oh, by the way, while, while we're mentioning Digital Dan, 60,000 subs, well done. Absolutely smashing it. But yeah, we'll be back on Monday, and then from Tuesday onwards next week, there'll be about another three or four Alton Towers videos to come. So if you've enjoyed this one, please hit the thumbs up. Little like button below does help us massively. Please subscribe. Many thanks for watching. We'll see you next time.